Yes. Um, yeah. My name is Rahul. I am a telecoms engineer working in Dubai since 2002. I want to ask a few questions. Coming from my background, I think religion is something that following that, you're saved from making, um, having problems in your life, yeah? Um, my first question is, I recently read a report by a doctor saying that because of marriages in first cousins in Islam, it leads to a higher probability of the fetuses being born uh, as handicaps, yeah? It increases the probability of the babies born without hands or without legs. So if it was something that could potentially cause harm, it should not have been allowed in Islam. Brother, there are two questions. The first question that is talking about consanguineous marriages. Consanguineous marriages means marriage between close relatives. In English, it's called as consanguineous marriages. And in consanguineous marriages, medical science tells us today, there are high chances of genetic problems. And I do agree with the brother. Mm. So why does Islam permit that? Yes. It's clearly mentioned in the Quran in Surah Nisa, chapter number 4, verse number 22 to 24, the woman who you can marry and the woman who you cannot marry is mentioned there. Amongst them, it's clearly mentioned you cannot marry your sister and a lady cannot marry the brother. It's mentioned. Neither the father, neither the mother. You cannot marry the brother of your father, the ladies, and you cannot marry the sister of your father. That means the important close relatives are mentioned in the Quran. Brother, sister cannot marry. Son and mother, father and daughter, paternal uncle, maternal uncle can't marry. But as far as first cousins are concerned, Islam does give permission. Now, as far as consanguineous marriages are concerned, the maximum problem comes when you marry your direct blood brother and sister. Consanguineous marriage. Even if you marry your direct father, daughter, mother and son, or your uncle, the chances are also there if you marry your first cousin, but it's negligible, very negligible. So no, it's that's not, not... That's not what the report said. The report said that because of marriages in first cousins, not your brothers and sisters, it let leads me, to this problem. Let and me it was from a doctor. Let, let it me was complete. published in Gulf News as well, actually. Brother, let me complete. Even I'm a doctor. Ah, okay. Fine. Even I'm a medical doctor. Yeah. It means medical doctor with that doctor. Yeah. The chances in direct relatives are very high. Yeah. If a sister and brother marry, the chances are very high. Yeah. If a father and daughter are very high, you have read only one report, you haven't read the other report. Uh, yeah. So you only read Gulf News, I read medical books. So right. Gulf News is better or medical books is brother? Right. Which so is your, better? Point is, your point is marrying in first cousins, uh, the lesser, chances of getting lesser, problem is negligible. As compared to brother and sister. As compared to, as compared to, but still, but still there is a... Brother, will you let me complete my answer or? Sorry, yeah, please. So you have more faith in Gulf News? No, no, not really. I'm here huh? to find the truth. truth. That's right. <laughs> so what do you realize? That consanguineous marriage, and I agree with you. I didn't say it's not there. Yeah. So I'm not trying to beat around the bush. But compared, it is negligible. Compared to direct blood brother and sister. Now, mm -hmm. I do agree that there are medical genetic problems in various ways. But this report is there when you have continuously generation after generation. According to Dr. Ahmed Sakari says, the Prophet said, do not marry first cousins generation after generation. Ah, if you do it once or okay. twice, it is no problem. Yet, even if you marry not cousins also, you can get a problem. Do you know that? Yeah, yeah. That, ah, so that doesn't mean that you stop marriage only. Right, so there is a ah. hadith which says yes. that do not do it generation after generation. Yes, but okay. otherwise, generally there is no problem. Right. Fine? Okay.